released video tonight after a January arrest in Joliet where a man died in police custody. WGN Shannon Halligan been going over that footage, joining us now with more on what it reveals. Shannon. Yeah, more than five months after Eric Lurie's arrest and death, his family and attorney finally saw the video and shared it with us leading up to this 37 year old's death. Get your feet up. Come on, get up. Let's go. This is the video from inside the Joliet police car on January 28th. Eric Lurie was put in the back of the car following a narcotics investigation. In the nearly seven minute video, it appears Lurie started chewing something. After they arrive at the police department, officers try to get Lurie out of the car. When he's unable to, an officer slaps him and yells at him. Eventually, one officer uses a baton to search inside Lurie's mouth while the other plugs his nose. Lori's family attorney, Michael Oppenheimer, called the video extremely disturbing for a number of reasons. And they should have called for an ambulance immediately. They hold his nose for one minute and 38 seconds, and then they stick a baton down his throat. Uh, that is simply unbelievable. Oppenheimer said police did several things wrong. Well, a long time ago, police used to try and do that, and they ended up hurting people very badly. And since then, the case law... The law is that you cannot do that. You can only render aid. And if you believe that he swallowed drugs, you have to wait for those drugs to come out naturally, or that's it. They were not trying to render aid to him. They were trying to get a conviction. There's no proof that he even had swallowed drugs. The family said they've been trying to get information from police about Lori's death for months. And if they knew they did nothing wrong, if they knew they were just trying to save this man's life, why did they not release the video when they had it, when this happened, and explain this to the public? Instead, they've hidden it. It looks bad. It smells bad. And I believe it actually is the murder of Eric Lurie. And we reached out to the Joliet Police Department for comment but have not heard back yet. The family attorney said that they plan to file a lawsuit as well as demand all the video and documents uh, related to this arrest. All right, Shannon, that is disturbing. Thank you.